Hi guys, my name is Mohammed Shahzad and I'm watching my YouTube channel Skillset with Shahzad. So today we will learn about uh, basics of uh, VMware Workstation. As we know, VMware Workstation is a powerful virtualization software that allows users to run multiple operating systems simultaneously on a single physical machines. It widely used for development, testing, and running various operating systems in isolated environment is a basic overview here is so we can check what we can do in our vmware workstation i have downloaded uh, vmware workstation uh, from the vmware website broadcom website direct is totally free for personal use if you guys new on my channel and you don't know how to download directly from vmware website which is broadcom now so uh, you can download and follow my video and download the VMware workstation. So let's go and check the purpose and use of use cases. Like there is different teams, they want to test different type of writing systems and you want to do your lab, your experiments. So this is then this uh, VMware workstation is very helpful when you don't have a lab environment like such PCs and other routers and servers you want to connect together you want to install a server you want to install a client machine and you want to test some softwares and how they behave so this is really a useful tool for you uh, to have a hands-on lab and practice your uh, what you want to uh, install in the corporate or in the business sector before that you want to do some experiments so this is tool is very helpful so it's a development ideas for the software developers and testers who needs to test application in different operating systems or configurations and uh, useful for IT professional and students to learn and practice system administration and network configurations it allows user to run a switch between different operating system without need separate physical hardwares. The features are very nice here like you can create a virtual machine here and you can give a like manage a virtual machines each with its own operating system and resources <coughs> cpu memory disk and space you can take a snapshots before doing any test and uh, after the test if you want to bring back the machine on the actual uh, configuration so you can uh, restore the snapshots and uh, cloning a virtual machine you already make a one virtual machine you want to create another one you just right click and make a clone and it will give you another copy of the same configuration of the virtual machines and the uh, network option configuring different networking options for virtual vms including nat network address translation bridging and host only networking there is a resource manager allocate resource like cpu memory and storage to each of your uh, machine according to your needs there's a different interfaces also display all your virtual machines and their status you can start stop and manage uh, vms from the uh, from the console vm console provides a windows into a virtual machine allows you to interface with it as it uh, if it were a physical machine vm settings where you can configure the hardware and other stuff let's go and grab some um, uh, turn on the uh, our uh, VMware workstation this is the VMware workstation pro which I have installed it's talking about this one and you can create a machine and during the creation of a machine uh, you can choose the hardware uh, which operating system you want to for example I have uh, I want to install like my 2000 uh, server 22 this one and next and you can choose the location and name of the machine and the hard disk and all if you want to customize the hardware here is the processor memory and everything you want to choose this is here so you can close and create and within some seconds it will create a virtual machines and you have a console here you can power on the machine here if you have give the ip uh, sorry the operating system media installation media it will bring it here we don't have any installation media so that's why it's asking uh, for that and then from here you can shut down the guest or you can restart or power on the machine and edit setting if you want to change the settings you can do it from here so it's talking about all these things so basic steps use a workstation install a vm download from the vmware workstation it's a machine create a new virtual machine install the operating system and configure the um, basics in this 
So it's a good for learning. You can have more uh, documentation from VMware Workstation website. It's available on the VMware uh, portal, Sport portal. You can download some documents regarding the uh, this uh, VMware Workstation. So this was the only uh, introduction I was want to give you for the networks. You can set from here. This one a complete one. Another video I will I will I will make that for you guys. So as of now I was just gonna give you a basics and hands on this uh, knowledge of the VMware Workstation. What things we can do in the VMware Workstation. How powerful it is. So it's really good for the labs and other stuff to learn. So hopefully you guys enjoy my video and uh, you have, uh, and if you are new on my channel, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the upcoming videos. And if you guys have any suggestions or uh, want to talk to me, please don't hesitate to give a, a comments. Uh, and uh, if you want me to make a new video for on a new topic, another topic, which I, I, if I know that, so I will make a video for that. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.